Yeah. Mr. Chicken. I went through a lot of ups and downs in life. Good times, bad times. But I learned in order to get success, you gotta do it by your damn self. I don't need no help, no assistance. I'm on my own. Oh no, we back at it with another Black Line production. I want to thank you guys for watching my video right now. And if you're new, I want to thank you for stopping by. As you guys see on the screen, we are playing Mad 16 for the PlayStation 4. I'm using my favorite football team in the whole wide world, the Baltimore Ravens. And I'm taking on Aaron Rodgers and the Green Bay Packers. I don't know when I'm going to let the video fly, but hopefully you guys have a safe and blessed day, man. I'm recording this video right before, you know, I have to go to class in the morning man I'm doing my first video in my new house man I'm so thankful and blessed to be able to do that man Cause, you know I'm living in a nice safe area man so I'm very thankful and blessed and glad we are finally settling but I know you guys have been watching football man we had a tough blow and a tough loss man you know we were so close to beating the Denver Broncos in Denver but you know the offense struggled heavily man trying to defend the pass rush and you know that loss of T-Sizzle didn't help at all but you know I'm not worried I'm not panicking man you know the former defensive player of the year Terrell Suggs is irreplaceable I'm not even going to deny that but you know the Ravens philosophy is the next man up and we have quality players man if you don't believe me look at Justin Forsett last year man you know he wasn't even supposed to make the team he ended up being a star in the National Football League so the Baltimore Ravens will be okay but you know i was in the watching the game of the uh, eagles and falcons game man i'm so impressed with the falcons man i expected them to get blown out i'm not even gonna lie to y'all but they, you know they persevered and hold on but as you guys see right here man we get a nice play with the one and only steve smith senior you already know he's my favorite wide receiver of all time when he came to baltimore man it was like my birthday but as you guys see right here man it is zero to seven in the second quarter three minutes and 53 seconds left to go and this game is going to be all about jordan now and man and I'm definitely gonna get blown out in this game I'm not gonna sugarcoat it I'm not gonna make no excuses man it is what it is my opponent just played a better game than I did and I gotta show him a lot of respect for that man Cause, you know I'm pretty good man and you know and the fact that you know my opponent definitely beat me down the way he did you know it definitely caught me off guard but I tell you one thing I'm definitely a better Madden player because of it but as you guys see in the second quarter two minutes in one second left to go. Aaron Rodgers throwing deep to the one and only Jordy Nelson. He makes an amazing play. I'm going to show the instant replay just in case you guys missed it, man. You know, he's another one who's going to miss the season because of an injury, man. I definitely wish him the best, but this was a crazy one-handed grab. Just had to show the instant replay just in case you guys missed it. And then they followed up with a beautiful run to one and only Eddie Lacy, who was one of the main reasons why Green Bay beat Chicago on Sunday, man. He's a phenomenal I'm gonna run that. But as you guys see right here, we getting it done with Joe Flacco, man. Many people sleep on his athletic ability, and you definitely believe I'm going to make my opponent pay for that. As you guys see, he's playing solid defense right there, but he's not watching a quarterback, so you know I'm going to scramble with Joe Flacco, man. You know, he definitely got wheels. But as you guys see, man, it's a closing seconds of the second quarter. You know, the score is not really getting any better, but you know, you know me, man. I'm going to battle back. I'm going to do what I got to do and try to compete in this game, win, lose, or win draw you know what I mean but as you guys see right there man it's the second quarter 25 seconds left to go we get the pass with Justin Forsett he misses the ball and we kick a field goal man but as you guys see right here man he gets the ball back he throws it to just um excuse me Jordy Nelson once again man like I said before man thanks again for watching the video so far man I really do appreciate it get ready for this halftime show because I know you guys are gonna enjoy it and I'll see y'all after I get back thanks again for watching y'all
Alright, we back from the halftime show. Hope you guys enjoyed it, man. That was gameplay footage of Fight Night Champion, a very fun and competitive boxing game that I definitely recommend for sports fans. And that halftime show, I was using the one and only Sugar Ray Leonard, and I was taking on the one and only Oscar De La Hoya, two legends in the sport of boxing. And then last Saturday night, we had another legend retire, man, by the name of Floyd Money Mayweather. You may not like him, but he is a, a defensive specialist and definitely legend and hall of fame man you know i'm so honored to say i've been able to watch Floyd Mayweather's career. I didn't see Ali's career. I didn't see Mike Tyson's career, but I can say I seen Floyd Mayweather's career, man. I'm so thankful as a boxing fan and a person who's an amateur boxer, you know, that I actually got to watch the career of Floyd Mayweather. But look at this play right here, man. This is so ridiculous. I'm going to show this a couple of times, man. This is a huge sack and huge deflating to me in my progress in this game, man. Joe Flacco with the fumble and my opponent ends up taking it for a fumble six man i couldn't believe that man that just destroyed all the momentum that i had but y'all already know how i get down man we're not going back down we're not going to give up even though there has been times where I rage quit. I'm not even going to lie to you. I'm not going front, but in this game, I decided to battle back, and then we followed up with a touchdown with Kumar Aiken. Like I said before, man, you know, the Ravens, we're going to be all right, man. We played it really, really well against Denver and Denver, and I still believe we're going to win the Super Bowl. I don't care what anybody say, man. I believe in my team, but I want to thank you guys for watching the video so far, and until next time, keep God in mind at all times. I'm the Black Lion, and I'm out.